All right, welcome back to our Guild Wars 1 playthrough in Prophecies. We just finished the Boreas Seabed mission. And now we are in Zos Shivros. This is another challenge mission for the Luxons, which we're not going to do yet. Then we're going to pick up this primary, uh, primary quest that's going to lead us back to Kaining City to hopefully take out Shiro. And you'll notice my skill bar is empty because I want to make a brand new skill bar. Uh, we're going to go back to Matu Keep, pick up a few skills. Um, I've never run this in my life, but I realized I never tried um, Keystone, Keystone Signet. I want to try and make a key, Keystone Signet build. Uh, basically, Keystone Signet means all of my signets except this one are recharged. And for 20 seconds... Each time I use a signet, or at least for the five times I use a signet to target a foe, all the other foes take damage and are interrupted. So the idea is you keep keystone signet and then you fill your skill bar up with as many signets as possible. We're going to get a few. I think I'm going to try the monk for this. Because monk has some smiting skills. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to search through here. And get some skills and then we'll see what I come up with all right this is the skill bar I came up with it is all signets and I don't know if that is uh, a good a good way to use this skill or not really it's only five times and obviously I have a lot more than five signets so I'm not really sure if I need to use five other sign or all other signets I've got one two three I've got, yeah, I could probably replace one of these with something else, but honestly, I don't know which ones are le less effective than the others, so I'm just going to experiment with all of them, and this might be a z disaster, it might not be, uh, but anyway, we have our primary quest, let's meet up with Master Togo and see what we need to do, so I'm going to get my henchman, uh, Do some of this action. And yeah, we're going all casters except Devona. This is going to be interesting. I have no healing skills at all. I guess I should go. Yeah, I'm going to keep the domination. <clears throat> all right. Let's just test it out. I want to test it out on some enemies here. So yeah, do I want to cast Sig... He's on Signet right away. I guess I should cast it first. And we'll just... We'll just spam all of them. I don't know if that was good or not. Okay. I'm not really sure what I'm doing, but I have no energy. I don't need to use energy, so that's kind of cool. Try it one more time. Cast this. Wait for a spell to come up. Interrupt that. I should put move leech signet up here. Is my interrupt spell? There we go. I mean that did a lot of damage. Seventy-one damage. Oh, that's what this with this did seventy-one damage. Yeah, I don't know what order I should go in. I really don't even need to use Bane Signet actually, but it does some it does 30 damage. It has a knockdown if they're attacking. Let's keep our leech sig or our interrupt skills at the front. Yeah. Interesting skill. Okay, let's see what we need to do. We need to go all the way over here. Master Togo. Yeah, it's a really confusing skill bar. Finlow has been telling me about Shiro's activity in the sewers, blah, blah, blah. Always tells me the same, same message at the beginning. Go down to the sewers and locate camp and forces. Find out whether they've been able to learn anything about Shiro's plans. Let's do that. So we go back to Matu Keep, I think. 
Can you go through the Shenzhen tunnels? And I think there's a back entrance here somewhere. Yeah. No sign. I think this... Yeah, Shenzhen tunnels. Let's put our skill bar to the test. Aku. Primary quest? No, it's not. Let us see how you fight on our tur turf. You have the courage to meet us in the Undercity. We'll be waiting for you. Your mother won't recognize you when I'm done with you. I'll pick it up just to see. I'm not going to do it right now, though. We need to head over there. But these sewers and inside Canton City are like a maze. So no guarantee I'm going the right way or not. This signet of humility is really interesting. Should use it on the monk, maybe. Oh, I should have used it right away. Would have disabled ray of judgment. That's some pretty good damage. There's some decent, um, decent recharge, decent spam ability. This unnatural signet does flat damage no matter what. Really good spell, or good signet rather. I'm gonna try not using keystone signet first. So I can like double spam them all. And then we use sig now I can use them twice. I don't know. I really don't know if this is good or not. Literally, you just you just spam. There's nothing holding you back. They're not skills, they're not spells, they're just signets. No cost. Nice, I blocked his Ray of Judgment there. That was good damage. That's good damage. Whoa, when they're grouped up, that's nice. Very cool. If, you know, there's so many signets in the game, so if you want to suggest which signets I should look be on the lookout for for this type of build. I'm all ears. I could have gone Necromancer. I could have gone uh, Assassin as well. I went with Monk because monk I was thinking of this Bane signet, but actually it's not that great, I don't think. I mean, it would be good against these warriors, but... All right, we met up with the Canthans. There's a lot of them. Seems like they're doing pretty well with themselves. Yeah, against Bane Sign, that's good against warriors and assassins like that. Alright, pretty easy. Let's, let's just fight these guys. Bunch of them. Disable that. Elementalist mind burn. I don't want to deal with that anymore. Sign of humility is nice. It's just like, no. No more elite skill for you. Not gonna bully us. The Keystone Signet damage is really important that they're grouped up, I guess, because it damages other enemies, not the enemy you're clicking on. So this, this has limited, uh, Limited function against single targets. Good to know. 
Men have been fighting and dying by the dozens, but the afflicted will not stop coming. You should talk to the emperor. Okay. These beasts have been attacking Maz with a number of orders to hold position, but as you can see, we're barely holding off. Okay. But we need to speak to the emperor in Raisu Pavilion. So we gotta go all the way back to Kanang City, I guess. A lot of jumping around here. If I get oh This is one of the coolest designs for a capital city, I think. I like the the multi layers. Very cool layout. Very cool. Very good level design developers. Oh, cool. Emperor's Hand, Emperor Kizu. Who do we talk to? Oh, these guys. He's got two other. Don't need those yet. Uh, can't the Empire suffer gravely? Many lives lost. My heart, blah, blah, blah. Fear of Arkham, Arkham Morris. We got that last episode. And then two episodes, you earn a victor. Got that one. Please speak to my tenant known as the Emperor's Hand. He will arrange passage into the sewers. Oh, okay. Battle in the sewers. We need to escort members of the guard and Commander Jafai. Help reinforce this position. We were just there. Why? We gotta go back? You know how much I love backtracking. Did I miss something? This is new. We have to immediately backtrack to her. I must have done something wrong. That's kind of lame. I have to do this all over again. It's not the worst thing in the world, but... All right, here we go. Give this another shot. I can't say I hate this build, but I also can't say I like it. It's kind of... I don't know what... Not attractive. Just put it that way. Just feels weird. Doesn't feel natural. I'm going to go ahead and queue up my Signet of Humility on the Monk. Try and interrupt that Ray of Judgment. He casts it right away. Yep. Eat it. Alright, they're grouped up there, so I'm going to blow them up. Doesn't seem to be working. Why am I not doing any damage? Are they not grouped up? Interesting. Oh, I should. I'm, I'm escort, escorting all these guards. They should be, should be letting them run in. Wow, we're gonna have a huge army with the minion masters and these guards. Put them to use. But I also. What happens if they die? I don't think they'll die. Too many of them. Yeah, if you precast the key Keystone Signet ahead of time, that's probably the best way to use it. Why are they just sort of standing there? Weird. Maybe they're triggered by the guards? They're not doing anything. It's so weird. Okay. Like, they're just turned the opposite direction. Are they broken? Do I 
target the mesmer. There we go. There's some damage. That's what I'm talking about. It's still grouped up. Okay, we're back. And we can get into the Sunjiang district, which should be the next mission. Let's go. I'm ready. Yes. <laughs> Always so many checks there. Cutscene? have arrived. Good. Let them come. The final mission? Question mark? Alright, I'm gonna try my best to find some players here, because this mission is kind of annoying if you... Because we, we have both the urn and the spear, so I'd like to find at least one player. We'll see how that goes. Alright, we're unable to find any players at the moment. I checked Kanang Center to no avail. Uh, we're just gonna try it out. Let's just do it, you know? I think we'll be okay. We got this far on our own. Mostly on our own. Uh, Want to get the minion master. Let's get some melee. Ravona and silver wing. That looks good. Let's do it. So this mission, we need to take out Shiro. Very cool mission. Hmm, which one should we... We can only bring one, since we're only one player. It'd be cool if they programmed one henchman to bring it and just use it, like the neck, the uh, ritualist. Do we go damage or defense? I feel like we go damage. I feel like this one is going to be easier to use. Of course. Yeah, we'll use this one. We're not necessarily getting attacked that much, I don't think. I mean, if it doesn't work, we just do it again. I believe Shiro has created spirit rifts, blah, blah, blah. Must destroy Shiro's constructs, his spirit rifts from gaining more power. All right. He's like shielded. So we have to defeat each rift one by one. Countless environmental hazards down here. Try and point out any damage we see them. Nevertheless, you must remain vigilant. Do it. The good news is since I don't use any energy. Um fine for us to be holding this spear. Want to always target the grouped up enemies. Oof, that was some big damage. Oh, 
So far, so good. We're carrying this game with our genius Keystone. I almost said Keystone Light build. <laughs> uh, almost Freudian slip there. Yeah, group up on me. That's fine. They are targeting me. Interesting. They want to keep it up. I'm going to have to drop this spear on their heads. Ooh, monstrous eye. That's some money right there. Alright, let's group them up. Oh, there's not that many of them. No enchantment for you. No elite skill for you. Stop attacking my teammate now. Oh, they're going after that assassin is going straight after Togo and Menlo. I wonder if they're I wonder if the assassin AIs are programmed to do that. It's not nice. Alright, so our first Okay, so those are dangers, they just ping. This is our first rip that we have to remove. Let's just drop the drop the spear right on them right away. Oh, I wasted my keystone. Boom. Done. Roy Griffs. Three more remaining. I think it's a pretty straight ahead mission. I don't think there's many like branches you need to worry about. I'll just find other rifts. Interrupted their resurrection skill there. Pretty easy so far. Look, Shiro's just up ahead. He has some type of shield protecting. We must destroy it before we can engage him. We're trying to. Yeah, so the, the spear charges much faster than the urn. I should be using it more often, actually. I keep kind of saving it for the next battle and the next battle, but I don't think I really need to do that. It's pretty, let's pick it up so I can charge it. Oh, each enemy defeated. Charges it up a level, I believe. Yeah. Every five enemies, I can drop it and deal 300 damage. Be careful here. Very easy to aggro. Get out. Get out of there. Okay, let's drop this. I was worried it would be out of range, but it wasn't. Oh, it looks like it charges even when it's on the ground. Because I just picked it up and it was already level 4. What about spirits? Do spirits charge it faster? No. Be careful here. I'm gonna ping my enemy, my teammates back. Come, come over here. Let the minions run in. There we go. Drop that sucker. Boom! Massive damage. That order of apostasy is really, really bad for inner, or enchantment running uh, teams.
Okay, I'm holding the spear, but it's not charging up. Why is that? Is it glitched? Yeah, my the spear's not charging. Supreme Spear of Arkhamoras. Interesting. There it goes. Yeah, that was glitched. Didn't show me the icon. Alright, uh, this is the right way. We gotta backtrack a little bit. He's telling me to worry out for the worry about the traps, and he's just walking straight through them. Practice what you preach there, Pogo. They're, they're like perfectly not grouped up. I kind of want to back up a little bit so they can clump up a little bit. My teammates are clumped up. Not fair. Yeah, this isn't- this is not a fun build, I have to say. It's fun when they're grouped, but when they're not, it's just like, no damage. We have another Supreme Archimoris drop here. Poison. Just run straight across. Drop this right on their head. Huge damage. Go back. I think the trick is following the blue lights. We go up there? Let's check. There should be a blue line that tells us where to go. Yeah, we gotta go over there. So, across here, I think. We didn't go this way. I guess it's not so straightforward as we thought. It, man, dang. The most dependable damaging skill is this unnatural signet, I think. And actually Bane Signet. Even though it's only 30 damage, it at least does damage. Okay, let's just be done with this group. Oh no 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 no. No 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 no. Not want to let it go. That's better. Add some damage. Keep that ray of judgment at bay. Get out of there. Oh, that wasn't a fully charged spear. It looked like it was. The camera angle is rough in that little corridor there.
pulsating growth. That's just disgusting. Alright, last one. And then... I don't think this ends the mission. I think we have to fight Shiro. But now he won't be invincible. Portals. Copies. See, we're dazed, but it doesn't matter. Our spells, our signets are not affected from days. That's pretty sweet. And I think this actually counters the um, shadow form, doesn't it? The shadow form just can't be the target of spells or can't be the target of skills. If that's the case, we can still use it. This, this build has its benefits, I think. It's very active, that for one. I was worried about this mission for some reason. Turns out... I had no reason to be nervous. Let's just backtrack. Oh, okay. Here we go. He thinks we're locked in with him, but actually he's the one locked in with us. <laughs> okay. Um, is there a safe way to do this? Assassin construct. Move. Two down. There's no Mesmer boss. Ritualist, Assassin, Ranger, and Necromancer. Well, this is very easy, I must say. I'm gonna save my spear just in case we have to fight Shiro. I don't think I actually need it. Didn't need... Didn't really need any of the items. Or either of the items for this mission, actually. Just the henchmen are enough. Let's change targets because... He's surrounded by spirits. So that's better. Just keep pushing the buttons. I don't know what they do. Take them out, guys. All right. Oh, that's it. We finished it. This was probably the easiest mission so far. Why was I so worried about it? Is he gone? I do not know. The spear of Akamora, the urn of St. Victor, were destroyed. Let us hope Shiro was as well. We have left this place behind. sides are just too far apart. What if we can't do it? Then Shiro will live. And the universe will spiral out of balance. I 
I suggest we split up. I will go speak with the Luxons. Menlo, you must talk with the Kurzix. They respect you. What should I do? You too must choose a side. Win the trust of either the Kurzix or the Luxons. And help us bring them together. To the Luxons. Interesting. I was mispronouncing that. Luxons. Some heavy prayers. And a little luck. Perhaps they will listen to reason. Let's hope they do more than just watch. What do you see? I must know. Tell me what will happen. I see the Emperor. The Emperor? What is he doing? The Emperor? Ah, he is going to kill you. No. No. You must be wrong. I am never wrong. The Emperor fears your great power, and he will kill you for it. No. You lie. Oh, dang. Heed my words. It will happen at Quan Jun Temple. Beware the harvest ceremony. You must make the choice. Him or you. <laughs> what have I done? That was uh, escalated quickly, as they say. Okay, so we finished the uh, Sunjiang mission. We're back in Matukib, and we're left with a real choice now, whether to, to uh, go back to the Kurzix and uh, side with them to get their help uh, to take down Shiro, or the Luxons, as Togo calls them. Um, now, you guys, if you want to comment and pick, uh, I'm not leaning one way or the other. Uh, so, if you want to, if if you're, if you want me to side with a certain uh, faction, leave a comment, and whichever one gets the most uh, votes, that's the one I'll go with. I think there's not. I think neither one is good or bad, right? There's no good guys or bad guys here. Just red or blue, right or left. Interesting. I see what they did here. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, I'll see you guys next mission and bye.